Hello, and today I am going to do the Marmite Challenge. Now, I didn't actually realise this was a challenge. I've been thinking of things that I could do, and I was thinking, I could eat a whole jar of Marmite on, and put it on YouTube. And I've had a quick look, and it looks like it's already a thing. Now, the thing is, people who know me, well, people who knew me in the late 90s, will know that eating a jar of Marmite isn't actually a challenge for me. It's the sort of thing I used to do back then. Um, started a one year at Reading Festival, I had no food, no money, apart from a jar of Marmite. I ate the whole lot, and then ever since then, it hasn't been a big deal. Now, I'm gonna confess, this jar has actually been started. The main challenge, normally people get a new jar and open it, but I've been looking at the videos, and the jars they're eating are actually quite a smaller size than this one. So I imagine I'm eating about the same amount. Um, can't really tell from that how much is in there. It's, a, it's, a, it's about there, so it's about that much, about half full, which is roughly what people are eating anyway on the challenge because I've only done the small jars. So um, I don't feel as if I'm cheating by having an open jar. And um, I'm just gonna go. Now this isn't really a challenge for me. I like this stuff. Um, there is one problem though, it does tend to make me go a bit hyper, and it is currently quarter to one in the morning. So eating this now, um, probably not wise because I should be thinking about going to sleep, not eating something that I know makes me go hyper. So. Now, I don't think there's a time limit on this challenge because normally when I do this sort of thing <clears throat> um, I just take my time so I could just sit here casually eat this and speed up the video although you might sound cheating I've already started with a jar which isn't full <clears throat> but hey what are you going to do? Now, I find it quite amusing that um, a lot of the uh, videos I've seen on here are from Americans that have never had this and their reaction is like, oh my god, that's disgusting. But the truth is, it's not designed to be eaten on the spoon, okay? You spread it thinly on toast, it's lovely. Okay, I love this shit, but even I find eating it on the spoon is a bit intense. But, not so intense. No, I can't do it. Although, having said that, it would appear my taste buds have changed somewhat since the late 90s. <coughs> so taste buds do change as you get older. Back then, this would not have been a challenge. <coughs> anyway, so I'm just going to eat along a little bit of time. The thing is, when I first did this, I was literally spooning little spoons like that, and it took me over the course of several hours to eat the whole jar, and the jar was about this size. <coughs> Whereas I've seen people in the challenge, they're just shoveling that in like that, that, that. So that's just insane. Why would you do that? Well, I know why you do that. <coughs> to get views, to get money. Anyway, so I'm just gonna eat this. Um, I'm not in a rush, okay? So I'm gonna um, find some music, um, stick it on, speed this up, and then um, here we go. Okay, I confess, I'm struggling. Late 90s was a long time ago. My taste buds have changed. You know, once upon a time this would have been easy. Um, 
and the people that know me now, that knew me back in the late 90s, would be disappointed in me for struggling to do this. <coughs> because it's the sort of crazy shit I used to do back then, before YouTube, before this was a challenge, but I just did that. I thought this would be easy, but really... Uh, Alright, um... I've had quite a lot. I've got a bit more on the spin to finish that off. Um, I probably have just eaten the equivalent of some of these small jars that people are doing the challenge with. I say this was a larger jar. Um, So, in my mind, I've done it. <coughs> but, I'm not the person I used to be. Uh. Okay, um... <coughs> I don't want to say it's harder than the Bean Boozle challenge that I did the other day. But... This is tough. <clears throat> Man. That's, that's mildly disappointing. Um, I, I reckon I did eat the equivalent of one of the small jars that people have been doing the challenge with, so I'm going to say that is a success because the people in the challenges are not using jars that size, they're using the smaller jars. And I reckon I did eat the equivalent of one of those smaller jars. Um, so, it's hard to tell really. I should have really... To make this a fair thing, so I don't have anyone commenting down below saying that I failed and didn't manage it, I should have really actually got one of the small jars, opened it up from new, and then finished it off and showed you the empty jar. In that way, that would actually stop anyone from doubting whether I did it or not. But Or, you could just come cut my stomach open and actually see how much marmite there is in there right now. <laughs> Or not, because I, I need my stomach, so yeah, don't, don't cut it open. Whew. So anyway, it's nearly one o'clock in the morning now, so I'm going to um, go wash out my mouth with lots of mouthwash, give my teeth a scrub and then wash my mouth out again, and go to sleep. Uh, my next video uh, will be posted on Sunday. That's going to be uh, another karate video of updates and everything on that. Okay, so I will see you then. Please subscribe. Thumbs up on this video. Even if people might doubt that I didn't actually eat all of what I said I did, but I did. So there. Just thumbs up anyway. It helps. Okay, bye.